I've got 10 hours into this game and haven't declared a single war yet. Well, it is different from uh, the other grand strats in that regard. It's not all war and savagery. That said, though, I really want to bring down these guys. Preferably when their fleet power is not superior to my own. But, Navara will have that covered, right? Because soon I'll be able to bring in the cruisers. And by soon, I mean right now. What I need to do is check out my current cruiser design. See if I can't... There we go, large weapon slot. You got any more of those large weapon slots? Because those I can do with. Yes, the Punisher Core. And then you're just medium and a couple of smalls. Not really sure which I prefer, we'll go with you. Auto complete the guy, but I'm not going to produce any of you just yet because I want my super rants beam on that. And I'll think about what I want my Corvettes to have as well. I didn't realize that, but Corvettes can have medium. Might be cool, might not be cool, I'm not sure. I have yet to really suss out combat and the best way to do it in this game. It's not like Europa where I can basically do as I please in it. That might sound a bit uh, cocky, but it's not without... Not without basis. I think everything is constructed that reasonably can be constructed. Granada I would still like to beef up a bit more. Might as well do it whilst it's cheaper, right? I want that. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, almost eight. So not quite enough. It's a trouble. I want to keep colonizing, but uh, can't sector everything, right? Well, there's a the thing I really can. I just want more direct control because I want to build these place up, places up to be super sciency. Look at uh, Vittoria here. It's one uh, one small letter C away from being something special. It's expensive, but let's clear all this junk out of here. So I have a decent complete. place to work with. I want them to be up to five pops so that I can, you know, do stuff with them. They're going to starve at this rate, though. I mean, they're already out of food, and this guy is going to turn them starving. So, hmm... I guess I could, uh, no, everything's being cleared. These guys are just going to starve for a wee while until this is cleared. So I'll cancel you and then set you to be cleared and then the food will be available at the very least. Jake, if Navara is full on pops and you have resettlement policy, why not send some pops from Navara to somewhere like Granada? This is a good point. And I'm wondering how much it's going to cost. So, for example, I don't need these minerals all that much. But, yeah, I do want population here. Okay, it costs influence. And we all know that I'm struggling for influence. So never mind that. But it is good because at least you get producing some pops here. So, I guess I could shimmy a couple of people over there. Because we make the food. Well, we make plenty of food around here as it is. So, I hope those guys aren't unhappy that they got shunted over there. No, they're as happy as can be. And even that helps with the, uh, the yieldage on my tiles, which is nice. In active buildings, that's fine. The pops can and will grow. And I figured these guys would st- Oh wait, no, that is my home planet that is now starving. I didn't see that coming. Well... Time to reposition, but why are you guys suddenly so starving? I'm sure they've got their reasons for it. Hmm. 
That'll be why, because that one made so much more food than the other tile. So I'm going to be replacing you. First I'm going to think what you have. Okay, it's just... Just food there already, so you're going to get replaced with delicious science. Aye, we make plenty more food than we need there. Looking good. I don't need these minerals that much. Jake, seconds before losing. Eh, we're not done yet. Okay, Rant's still looking good. He's yet another off-world miner. Why is everyone so keen on that? Updated. I cannot fulfill that mandate. I hope there isn't a uh, punishment for not uh, completing it. Because I don't have those mining stations to build. There's nowhere to go and do it. Unless unless it counts deleting existing ones. Which would be a bit of a joke. Uh, that's inside the enemy's space. Well, not enemies. These guys are hardly my enemies. As long as I don't colonize... You are but a chick, and yet to show such wisdom. Oh, and yet you show. Hmm. Patronizing fool. But I wonder... Research complete. Would he ever offer civilian access? No, they will not. Fallen Empire scum. Habitability goes up. That's all well and good. Federation, resettlement. Oh, I could have done with that, couldn't I? And colonizing Arctic worlds. Now we'll just get more food on the go. Construction complete. Star charts in exchange for star charts. Absolutely not. I got no good reason to do that. The only thing I've got good reason to do is to curb the growth of these guys. Uh, greetings. Do you have anything interesting to offer? I offer you death. How you like that? Uh, no, not Sill. I want Rants on the case there. <sighs> Research complete. Halfway curious how the Baleries are going to get on sectorized. Yeah, that's not the Valerys I'm looking for. Ugh, they'll be fine. Can't really influence them here, but even if it grows up fully, they won't starve at least. Yeah, I don't see any reason to be influencing that much from here. Trait points, always good. That's a very expensive thing to get. But it's rare and Xeno Cavalry. These sturdy war beasts make excellent mounts once they have finished bonding with their riders. They can traverse almost any terrain, have power, and have proven very effective in scouting and raiding roles. Let's get the SARS on the go. Battleships, nuclear, engineering, basic wing fighters. I don't know anything about these uh, fighter deployers, but I do know about getting my science groove going. I like getting my science crew going. Station under attack. Hostile fleet engaged. Station under attack. Man, I know I fought them, but why are these guys such assholes? And is there any way to stop them? Because I want them to, you know, stop attacking me all the time. Can't we just let bygones be bygones? Jake, you're losing credits fast. Upgrade buildings on Navara. See, Navara is up. is upgraded. Excellent. Can finally get that planetary capital. And we are going to be needing that extra food, whether I like it or not. Complete. Hurting a little for the food, aren't we? Vittoria, you'll just keep growing of your own accord. And these guys, Jings, I need to clear you out expensive though it may be. I'll start with everything close by you. Then I can get my adjacencies from you. 
Otherwise... Yeah, you're gonna be an expensive planet to make worthwhile. Another tundra world around here. But it's pretty crappy. Well, that's not the one I should be looking at. Oh, it is. That's the thing. Hmm. Hmm. So many small worlds. I'm glad I found Granada. I am very glad I found Granada. Research complete. You know, the uh, Fallen Empire that I found have been moaning on and on about their uh, chosen worlds and all that. Their holy sites. But I haven't actually found one that is holy, have I? Yeah, the high gravity is here. Actually, this is an excellent uh, province to colonize. Sure, the building cost drives up the... Or the high gravity drives up the building cost. But we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I can get enough pops to get this all the way up and then just sectorize this whole area. And that'll cover a couple of... Pla oh, man. I should be making this planet look a lot better than I currently am. I just want to tweak it more myself. The thing is, I'd rather tweak them massively and then give them to sectors and say, do not touch what I have done, because what I have done is great. But these guys do need to breed, and breed fast. But then these guys also need to breed. Okay, what this is telling me is that I need another colony ship, and I need to sectorize something else. Like this. Didn't I establish you so that I could tear down this? Oh, okay. This isn't so good. These guys are actually expanding their influence and pushing out what uh, could, would, and should be mine. That's very nasty of them, and I don't like that. Because didn't this used to be mine? Didn't it? I think these guys are going to have to go uh, go down a notch for what they're doing. Still, let's see what happens when I just disband this. <laughs> I love peacetime mechanics. This game proceeds to ignore all of his colonies. Harsh, but true. Alright, we got that super... Uh, what was it? Super duper rants beam. Which means I'm going to check out the ship designer for our cruiser and say you get the particle rants. Two of. Oh my days, it drinks our energy. And I only have basic fusion reactors here. Well, isn't that amusing? I'm going to need some better reactors. Oh well, the more you know, we're researching them as we speak. Hmm. Yeah, really not a fan of the way he's pushing the border against me here, and I'm not pushing back. Because I don't have things that I can really colonize on the border here. But he took over quite a lot of my minerals there, and I don't appreciate that. Jake, I'll stop spamming if you just give Yan Does a quick glance. Construction complete. Give Yan Does a quick glance, huh? Well, ain't that something? I guess I can get some of that mining station on the go. Oh, well, what are you going at? It's not even inside my realm. Wasting my time like that, Sidwe. Construction complete. There is more money to be made. Let's make it. There's more science to be made. Which kind of science? I think we're short on the physics science. There's more food to be made. It's regrettable, but I should be doing that. Granada. I want it completely full. Once it is full and I've uh, topped it all up, I can sectorize it. 
And we still have our edict on the go here, right? Infrastructure. Keeps going for another three years or so. I should then spend everything I can in building up its juicy science. The one thing that I'm kind of neglecting is the fact that these science uh, places also cost money in upkeep. Mm, that said, though, I would probably benefit from getting a bit of mining going on to synergize well with this. Either mining or money. And we know how well we went when we focused too heavily on money and not on the mining. Hmm, happiness, eh? They've got 85 happiness, that keeps them happy. Ecstatic would be better, but it's all about the max happiness that's keeping them down at the moment. That'd be solved to somebody who's working on the Frontier Clinic, that would bring them up to 90. Let's investigate that for a moment, shall we? Eh, you'll be built up soon enough. So do I want energy credits or minerals from here again? Probably just mine that stuff. And mine that stuff. But I still want lots of juicy science on the go. So in these ones that are only suppressing one, I'm happy enough to keep that science flowing. And we'll do it now whilst uh, building is cheap. Hopefully that's going to be enough food between the, frankly, very few places I am uh, creating food for them. We have six bonus, but as we can upgrade this in time, that probably still won't be enough. That's unfortunate for them. Maybe instead of the mining network, I should get more food on the go. No, instead of this one, I should have food on the go. I can always replace it later on if need be, or maybe the sector can. Slave mineral output, we're not a slaver. Not yet, at least. But I need that leader capacity. The lack of a war fleet is something that's uh, poor for me. They're equivalent and wary, apparently. <sighs> Jake, is there a VOD of today's lewd stream? I can't find it in the recent videos. Uh, I usually forget about putting them live for a wee bit. It'll happen eventually. What time do you work, Jake? I need to be back in the office in about uh, less than nine hours. But man, I just really want to play some uh, Stellaris. Is that such a crime? Okay, lovely. We're able to push our own border here. So, science ships, stop whatever nonsense you're doing. And survey these systems that now we are pushing. This isn't so good. I wonder why they have so much more push than we do. Probably because this is a small, crappy, underdeveloped uh, colony. And it could be so much more. And they're starving as well, funnily enough. Probably not very funny, but... Let's, uh... Let's get a frontier clinic on the go. That should, that should provide them with all the food they really need. Reassembled ship shelter is not quite enough to get. Now, if you're starving, have food, you fool. And you're going to need to go here. That'll give us just a wee chunk of extra food. Cloud lightning, mining laser, combat rolls, disruptor. So many things, but at least... Mm. Okay, no, I need more power. I believe in you, Jake. Who's to say that you can't keep playing Stellaris until you literally have to get out of the door? <laughs> <laughs> the thing is, I got errands to run as well, so... Well, the one more turn symptom is real. I need to get these solar panel networks on the go before I forget. Who are these strange ones? That's in the new place that I'm investigating, right? Which means forget doing that, survey that system instead. 
And uh, you two, it's time to group together under Glorious Rants. Get rid of any enemy that stands in our way. This looks like a promising system. It's no soul, but it's something. Jake, can you show us the ship designer and the weapons DPS you're using at the moment? I haven't been touching upgrading my ships at all. So if I look at my... I think I have two destroyers and they're very basic stuff here. So uh, damage is 8.81, but if I were to actually make a new one, it would go up by 20%. Twenty percent is a bit high, maybe fifteen. And the Corvette's probably even worse. It's six point eight. It's six point three eight at the moment. Mm -hmm. Point is, we're not doing very good with our uh, weapon research because we're trying to build up a strong economy, right? Strong economy means strong nation, if I can be believed. glad we're pushing into these guys, but we could do to push harder. I'm not happy about having lost this, though. I wonder if they come under my control if, uh, if I push back. Construction complete. I stuck a wormhole station complete. there, the, uh, the nasty piece of work that they are. Shouldn't you be surveying that system like I told you to? Jake, also keep in mind to upgrade science and construction ships for faster speeds and research. It is a thought. Did you hear about the newest Civ announcement? Civ 6. Civ has never been something that uh, excites or even interests me, so I can't say... Can't say I'm sold on it. These jokers. This I might want to investigate, but only might. Ah, uh, they're getting nowhere through our shields. Down goes that. Back to Navarra you go to rest up for a job well done. I'm sure... Hmm? Oh, these things again. I'm not concerned, they're just going to fly through my areas and do not much. That said, though, I don't like them existing. Rants take them down. You're not rants, you're battle boat. Well, that's okay as well. But once you're done, get back to Nevada. An added world here that's colonizable. And it's ever so technically inside our space. And that's a pretty big added world on top of that. I oh, might as well stop to check it out. There's no harm. If I take this, it might push us that bit further into these guys' space. Hopefully it's not their holy world or anything like that. Arctic. Pool size. Leader capacity. Wait, what does that do? Research complete. Oh yes, of course, but I could get double that here for cheaper, or I could get better farms, and better farms are probably... Now, nah, let's get that. All these good things I want for my fleets, so maybe getting better thrusters would be for the better. Nah, I need to mine as well, and it's nice and cheap. The Yut Empire, we've recovered artifacts from the ancient alien civilization on Brigata Ila. Our scientists think they inhabited this region of stars roughly six million years ago. Exceedingly rare for them to travel abroad. A single individual could reach a length of nearly a hundred meters as an adult. Wow, Situation okay. Log updated. So I got some stuff to research about these guys. I need to find their artifacts. If we can find enough relics from their civilization, it may be possible to pinpoint the location of their home system. But we don't know where we're going to be finding those uh, relics. Maybe we'll come across them. After all, the galaxy is vast and full of wonder.
Hostile fleet engaged. Why are they so hostile anyway? They're really not doing anything, it's just me coming along, seeing them, and uh, deciding they're not allowed to exist anymore. Updated. These guys continue to grow, though I don't like the idea of their fleet being superior to my own. Okay, Navarra then, your spaceport. You have the crew quarters, which is good, but... I can't help but feel I would like something better there. Senator Rance. An unfulfilled election. I tried as much as I could, but there was only so much I could build. Get over here. There's mining to be done. There's Research always complete. mining to be done. System survey complete. Mineral silo I care not much about, but... Rant selected as sensor. Yes, if we check him out, if we can actually find the right thing to click on. Sensor Rant, Basque as he is. He's a... <laughs> he's an architect. And he's an investor. He does us very well. And he keeps everyone super happy. 20% extra. That's not down to him, of course, but I'll take it. Yeah, unimpressed by the way they've pushed on us here. I need to do something about this. But all I can really do is grow. Grow and grow excellent. Let's stop you from being the repurposed space... Uh, Research space complete. colony ship because I don't want anyone diverging away unlikely as it is same for you you guys can feed yourselves so we have three ones that really need to grow up oh we got a ton of minerals though as soon as I can build a half decent uh, ship mining network I like that a half decent ship would probably include these antimatter power cells. So I can get my Rance beam on the go. I'll be able to start producing my. Uh, what were they again? Destroyers? I often forget how it goes. Oh, I want these. I want better everything. Anomaly found. Mm, I reckon you've got it in you. Research it, please. Actually, is that edict still on the go? It might be. Granada, tell me more. It's still on the go for another month and a half. So, whilst we have tons of minerals, let's upgrade everything and build everything. I still need more physics research. But yeah, if it can be built, make it built. We're looking fine on the food. Soon we'll be able to make this even better, but that time is not right now. I need more delicious science. Delicious science. You're being built. For me, this is pretty high on the amount of mining to be done on one planet. But I guess needs must at this point. Another farm, and looking good. And then there's you, where I haven't built anything. Poor planet. I'm keen to get this stuff cleared away. It's not very important to be done. In fact, I would hazard it's not important at all. But I want to do it. Also, you are well and deserving of a frontier clinic. love having everybody nice and happy. But why are these guys only at 80 when, for example, at the home world... Okay, the governor helps out with that. And being joyful gives them a huge bonus. 
83 is only enough for the happy. You guys are at 88, which is still just happy. So governors really help out with that. I can probably stack happiness a bit better, though. In before Jake rolls in his overcompensator fleets and gets wrecked by a pack of corvettes because he didn't put any small guns into the mix. The small guns will be put into the mix by the corvettes that I have. Hopefully. I mean, that's a grand plan, right? At least we'll get our antimatter reactors. Strike force will be uh, upgraded. And what about these extra class raiders? They're not exactly the same, and it's a real shame that I didn't get their um, important stuff. They had some new tech on those ships, and I did not absorb them into the collective. Don't you have uh, stuff to be researching here? Please get on it. And then there's you. I would like to start growing on you. But then I would end up sectorizing all of this. Which is not System beyond what I want to do, but... Research complete. I need more core planets here. Mm -hmm. Shield hit points, UV lasers, point defense. I like point defense. I do like point defense. Heck, I like lots of things. But that's good enough. I should start thinking about how to make better everything at this point. So let's clear this design completely, auto-complete it. Some shields with some regenerative hull tissue. Does that really matter when I don't have a hull? Well, I'll just get some regular armor on it instead. I mean, is regenerative hull tissue that much better? I consider this for a sec. Okay, well it gives one armor, whereas this just gets the hull up and on the go. Alright, I'll stick that in. Small blue laser, small rail gun, small blue laser. I like it, I like our little pearl. Not to be confused with the Phoenix Wright character. Pearl I was never fond of. Cruisers that I don't think we're really using. Oh wait, no, of course not, we don't have them yet. Let's clear out that design, auto-complete it. And the game knows that we deserve those particle, uh, particle lances. A little bit of point defense and some small and medium railguns, but particle lance helping us out a lot. Destroying the armor, and uh, I think railguns do good on shields, such as what I've heard. No armor whatsoever, because we don't know anything about armor. And defensive combat. Stay in formation and fire at nearby threats. Or I can give you offensive charge straight at the enemies. Now nah, you guys should sit back, relax a little. I can get behind that. And then destroyers, which I have not been using at all. Hmm. Medium, small, large. Yeah, I can get faith, large faith breaker on you. But uh, hope breaker and... Yeah, you should have some medium uh, stuff going on here. Aye, I can get behind that. Jake, lower left corner, you can auto-make designs. auto jo Whoa, okay. Interesting. Didn't I just make a whole bunch for me? Okay, this is making too many for me. I didn't... I didn't... I didn't ask for any of these. I mean, this guy has another particle lance, a big one. Hold on, a battleship? I don't have access to battleships. Never mind that. I don't like these auto ones. I don't trust them. Not when I can trust my own instincts here. Did I just delete my... Uh, science ship? Auto complete you. Don't really think that's all that desired, but sure. And there was another one we didn't do well. The colony ship, granted. Does it even need to be that good? It's already pretty expensive, so sure. Colony, science, and... I see the defense platform is pretty cool, but I don't really build those.
hangar station section has one hangar point and it sends out scout wings. Hmm, is that necessary? Is that even good? Couldn't even tell you. But there was one thing I didn't do, that was construction ship. Auto complete it. They only have assembler core, why would they need anything else? Construct a wah. Alright, good enough. Now we're looking to Nirvana for this. For one, I need to upgrade you, and for two, I need to build some new stuff. It's going to cost a fair chunk of minerals and probably take a long time, but I'm not in a sudden hurry to be uh, going to war here, right? But what I will want are those cruisers of mine. Five cruisers. I mean, what could go wrong with that? And then I'm going to need you fully upgraded. Jake, to make sectors, you had to research something, and you can improve government in the Empire screen. Well, yes, I can change this, but I'm not sure what else you're getting at. All these policies still looking good for me. I would not want that welfare program, though. Lose loads of your stuff just to get happiness. Why? Okay, no, actually, that makes a good bit of sense. If that bit of happiness increased your yieldage, then that would almost pay for itself. But not quite. Hmm. I am tempted, so very tempted, just to colonize this. Just so I can stick it in the face of you. Arrested development of Governor Wu Zhao. Arrested development is awful, he's going to stop growing. But he's at level 5, so I guess he can do whatever the hell he wants. Was I imagining something? Traits, arrested development, but it's not showing here. Probably because it doesn't matter, because he's at max level. Good job, you. Now I have a larger leader pool and plenty of influence. It would make a world of sense to get some governors for these area, uh, these new planets. In particular, the really nice big ones. So let's recruit someone. Recruitment cost is something I like. Food, nah. Cheapness. Cheapness is something to be uh, appreciated. There's also you, but you are small and crappy, and do I even care? The answer is I don't. You are kind of big and not so crappy, and you're close enough to the frontier here. Hold on, am I imagining things? Why have I not called you the... Uh... Oh, I recently took this over. Neither the Tartarus? I need to give you a new and better name. Now, I'm not actually feeling these uh, new Basque names, so I should go by provinces... Uh, that were in EU4, and I certainly took Aragon. Aragon is ours now. And very soon, and by that I mean, oh, very, very soon, I'll be getting you upgraded, and I will not be worrying about Ethic Divergence anymore. Ethic Divergence, I think, goes up inside a sector, Something I can check out in the Balearis. Okay, I did not expect it to be like that. Why are you not upgrading that to reassembled ship shelter? I need you to do that pretty much Research now complete. before everyone starts Agreed. going away from uh, my ways. Probably should have gotten that ship upgrade cost reduction for upgrading all my ships. But again, you can't worry about these things. Advanced or selected lineages. It's just a policy, not one I overly care about. Since it increases the cost and leader skill levels. Huh. That could actually be uh, pretty useful. But not so useful that I'm going to take it over more food. Jake, give the sector resources so they can upgrade buildings. It's not like I have a ton of resources myself, but... Research complete. How much does it even cost to upgrade that thing? I 
Maybe it's not going to do anything unless I give it a leader. I do not know. But I... There we go. Once it's planetary administration, these guys will uh, slowly but surely come back to the fold. And then... Uh, he makes minerals. He makes money. Kind of. He'll get it sorted out. Even if I have to subsidize him a touch. And that's what I need, some actual armor. Science ship is lazy and not doing anything. Which means it should get back to... No, you've got it going on. Granada wants their research. Damn, that assist research. I just love it to bits. It's almost free science. A little concerned about my southern neighbor. He's building up. Their fleet is apparently overwhelming in comparison to mine. And they are a decadent hierarchy. They've got to go. Well, we'll have our fleet all upgraded. Ha! <laughs> like that. We'll get our super cruisers on the go. And I can't help but feel we would uh, benefit from having yet more super corvettes. Although these are going to take a while. Maybe I could pop over to somewhere else like Granada. Although I would be happier if you were a Corvette assembly yard. And then we'll have you doing all the Corvettes. Remember, Corsica was vital for your government switching gambit, Jake. It deserves to be a planet. I also agree with that. It's looking acceptable here, but it'll look even more acceptable if I got rid of the United Dabax tribes. The tricky thing is taking over those planets. What am Research I going to do with them? Complete. I want to tinker with them, which means I'm going to need to sectorize a lot of planets that I already have. Hmm. Three, really, because I'd be taking three in the war. But I don't want to sectorize Granada. It's super good. That means sectorizing... You, and you I don't want to, though. I mean, I can get sectorizing these, but that's only two. I just need more directly controllable core worlds, but that is mid-tech. I don't even know which of these would be best. I'll go for the shortest one. Jake, probably worth building an engineering bay as well before mass-producing corvettes out of that station. Uh, the thing is, I kind of want them fast. But you don't make a bad point. You also cost maintenance. Uh, yeah, okay, sure. Research complete. Hmm. Great as clone armies may sound. Good point, though. I should pop over to Nevada and start building an actual army here. With good enough bombardment, ten should be plenty. But, shoulda, woulda, coulda, let's get another assault army. Ten and ten seems good. Research complete. Even better armor, but it's difficult. Ooh, battleships. Get assembly yards for those as well. Nah, I think I'll avoid that. I appreciate the reduced build cost, but I also appreciate getting more minerals. And I also appreciate our nah, minerals. Power hub wouldn't be a bad idea on our home home planet. 
but even better react. Ah, that will take forever. I do like throwing that plasma though. Eating ship armor. It's troublesome. It's throwing loads of things that I want at me, but there's only so many things I can have. Economy, shield. Oh, well, we focus pretty heavily on shields, so it couldn't hurt to get those better. Jake, are you sure you can't build battleships? Or do you mean, are you sure so oh, you cannot be. build battleships? I am only at cruisers here, but I'll live. Construction Ooh, complete. Yes. Advanced real gun, great, but Teldar crystals, extremely durable crystals that enhance the armor piercing capabilities and destructive potential of projectile weapons. They also be, happen to be popular as gems. Sounds like money to me. The energy credits that I'm currently getting do not sound like money, however. I'm going to need to think how to exploit that situation. Navara's not making us enough. Granada ain't making us jack. Has plenty that I could upgrade, granted. Such as the farm. But looking at it, we make plenty of food. I don't think I'm going to need to upgrade this one as long as I have that one. Hmm, but I do worry for my lack of money. Okay, the, you would be better replaced with the power hub to boost the amount that I get out of these. But you're only a level 1 power hub, so... It'll be a bit of a step back, but also probably worth it. It's a shame it knocks it down by two, but it'll boost it by more than two, so I can I can live with that. Keep the minerals pouring in, but yeah, I need energy credits at this point. This wonderful uh, world that I have now cleared out should be pretty good for it. Can get you up to planetary administration, which I really appreciate. Soon you too will be planetary administrated. And you already are. But you could be making me quite a bit more money. Habitability is good, but could be better. Especially if I had... Da -da 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 -da. Frontier Clinics. But most importantly, I just want these guys to breed. I can always really push the amount of building I do here with uh, an edict and then keep it going from there. Don't like hemorrhaging those energy credits though. I can't believe I'm about to say this, but I think you may have too much science as f for as few planets as you have, Jake. Aye, we do have a lot of science on the go. But... These planets are ripe for the exploitation without science. I can take this one, it's huge, but there's it doesn't really lend itself to science. It has, what, two tiles that I can see that actually contribute to science, so maybe I'd want to put them there, but for the rest of it, I should be exploiting this for the money it can give. Could, should, and I think I will. If I hub this, yeah, I think I will hub that one. And then, yes, yes, let's make some money. Let's make some goddamn money. Uh, then again, maybe I should pass an edict here. It's not like I'm hurting for influence. Yeah, we'll get an infrastructure project on the... I've got to stop saying on the go all the time. Uh, sure, it was a bit expensive, but it means we can build these things nice and cheap. So I'm going to focus on the power first. Which means power hub. And power plants are plenty. If it's empty or it's producing money like this, it needs a power plant on it. This will not be a very scientific planet. This will be quite the opposite of a scientific planet. But it's going to make us good money. There's plenty of food to be had around here. Oh, there was this guy, so it makes sense that you would give us science. 
So there we go, only three science labs, it needs no more. And there's going to be a lot of minerals to be had here. Plenty here, so I'd be as well, if I have to make the decision on this one, get a power plant. Jake, make Belfarian power plants instead of regular ones. I don't want to build those on planets that I am going to sectorize, if that makes much sense. Of course, that's tricky because Navarra is the only province where I'm almost guaranteed not to sectorize it. But I think what I'll end up doing is replacing this with a Bathyrian, which means I should cancel that and replace it with that Bathyrian power plant. And there we go, all of our Bathyrian thingamajiggers will be used here. Hold on, wasn't this a... Uh... Ah, it was one mineral. And this one was two. Oh well. Fit Kinemendi. So we're building up here with a bit of luck. These guys won't be quite so overwhelming. They'll probably still be superior to us though. Right. I'll show them what's for. Oh my, we're doing good on the uh, resources to discover. And it only takes four months. So those nice stones, sadly I'm not seeing anywhere inside our empire that they can be grabbed. But it is pretty late and I'm pretty tired, so no guarantee on what I can see. But we're looking alright. So Granada, how are you doing on the whole uh, spamming my corvettes? You know, do I really have the best corvettes I can do at the moment? Apparently these ones are a bit better. Damn though, they're, uh, they're pretty expensive. I think just building ten of those is going to send me quite a bit into... a world of expense. Also, why do I have all these auto... I said off with that one. Didn't want these auto guys. No, sir. I'll figure them out myself. Why am I not mining this? Probably a good reason, but why am I not mining this? Don't think there's anything else that has miraculously come under our control that we can then exploit. This is okay. Research complete. Alright, what's the odds that uh, good old Rance is going to make it again? He's getting on in years at 104, but he still drives down our building costs in a way that I really can get behind. If any of these don't have solar panel networks, they're doing me a great disservice, including the one here. slammed down that edict so I should well be uh, looking to build up our mining networks here as well even though they cost money that I don't currently have I wonder if they cost money when they're not in use that would be most embarrassing but still I'm building them anyway I don't think I need yet more food here but I do and you for some reason wish to move away to Granada you do me a disservice I can't remember if I stuck down a hub for money here. I think I did. Teldar plant? Requires those rock things that we don't have, right? Oh, we do. Okay. Empire unique and empire unique happiness. Yes. Yes, I can get behind that. Increases the happiness on this planet, and I want it to be very productive, so sure. 
Um, hold the phone. If I end up sectorizing that, where are these strange crystals? I blink once, I blink again, maybe I'll see it. Aha, here they are. Hmm. It's not going to work, is it, if I uh, have them there? I guess I could always have Granada ne uh, never part of uh, a sector. And that allows me to build it up there, but I've already built Granada to the hilt. Guess I was thinking of getting rid of that food. But I still have a lot of pops ready to come here and barely the food to feed everyone. So I think I will need this. Hmm. Jake, shouldn't you also dock construction ships not in use? Uh, these guys are in, in dock. I guess the construction ship is not, and that's a good point. Okay, I don't like the idea of them having a building that they can't even use there. I do like the idea of you getting upgraded so these guys don't diverge away. I know they want to spread their wings, but not in that way. Our censor's reign has come to an end with their election campaign promises unfulfilled. Is that because they're unfulfillable? Because I think it is. Jake, would you name a new planet Toledo? If I uh, come across one, yes. Yeah, looking pretty equivalent to me these days, you disgusting pacifists. Mm, that building maintenance is going up. That ship maintenance is going up. Everything's just going up. Plus the maintenance on the armies that we're now recruiting. Construction complete. Perhaps I could be doing something with these new uh, planets that I'm building up Construction on. Construction complete. Especially since they don't appear to be doing much with it. So, for example, there's no need for excessive science around here. So, Construction complete. power plant away. I barely need any food as well. We have our frontier clinic. You two together will probably feed most of the place. Maybe one more farm over here? Otherwise, what'll I do with the place? Just turn it into money, money, money. I do love money, money, money. I can't even build the hub yet until we upgrade a touch here. But this will help. Research complete. And there's Aragon, you're so crowded there. See, I don't see the reason in ever not building the power hub. It costs a bit of influence and a bit more to build at the start, but it produces as much as a regular power station. And even if there's just one other... Okay, that's pretty good. Almost too good to pass up. It's going to save us a bit of space and planning. Why do I get the feeling that Jake isn't syncretic to the pacifist faith? I haven't declared war on a single bloomin' person, so I won't be having any of that held against me. Well, would you look at that? I would say we have a half-decent... Uh fleet on our side here. Ignore the science ship and the construction ship. We've got a nice 3,000. You We're still think you're better out. than me? All is equivalent, apparently. I like to think my rants laser will help us out there. I should blow these guys up, though. If I just take them